I had a special request from one of my subscribers to take a look at the different wallpapers. Also, I'm going to show you how to change the wallpaper in Windows Server 2025. So this is the default wallpaper you get. And I'm going to go into the personalized area, which you just get to by right clicking anywhere on the desktop. And once you're in there, I'm just going to go ahead and make it so it's not maximized so we can see the changes. Here are the different wallpapers. So here's the first one. This one is basically going to turn everything into dark mode, but it has the same picture in it. And now we'll take a look at the next one, which is this nice scenic picture. And that's followed by this purple one, which looks a little bit like a planet or a sun. Let's take a look at this next one here. So when I'm changing these pictures, it's also changing the theme as well. So if I click on the start button, you can see there's dark and light themes. And now we have a picture of the sun. And that's pretty much it for the different themes to apply. So now I'll click on background. So here you can choose the picture, which we just showed the recent images. If I click the drop down, you can choose a solid color, just like every other version of Windows. You could also choose a slideshow, but you would need to have pictures in your pictures folder and able to do that. So it's very similar to other versions as well. And then you have the option for Windows Spotlight. The idea of Spotlight is rotating pictures that you'll see you'll see different ones throughout your time in your Windows session. I'm going to go back to Picture, and I'm going to choose to Browse Photos, and I'll choose the photo that's on my desktop. So go to Desktop, choose that picture, and now we can see that picture that I took is now on the desktop. I'm going to switch back to that theme that I had earlier. And here you can see that it's going to fill the image. You could choose to fit the image. In this case, it shows that uh, it's not quite the same format as what I have, so it has a little bit of uh, sidebars there. You could stretch the image, and that typically will go ahead and distort things a little bit. You can also tile the image. So in some cases, tile the image is basically going to show a whole bunch of smaller pictures instead of one giant one. But in this case, it does the same. Centering the picture, as you see here and spanning the picture. So if you have multiple monitors, it's going to span all those monitors for you. Under contrast themes, you can see if you have uh, vision issues, you can go ahead and change to different themes if you'd like. So I'm going to choose the drop down, choose aquatic, choose apply, and there you have it. Now the desert. Dusk, night sky, although I don't see any stars, and we'll go back to none. So there are your different themes and background options in Windows Server 2025.